Hey there, Wayfinders. Hybrid here with another character spotlight. I'm thrilled to introduce you to a remarkable scoundrel who's ready to shake things up in the battle against the gloom. Today, we're shining the spotlight on Silo, the tactician. Born into a family of smugglers, Silo has honed his skills by living life running under the radar and challenging tyrants. Now, he's using those same skills to fight the gloom. Silo is a low to medium difficulty Wayfinder that thrives at both short and long range. He seamlessly switches between melee and ranged weapons during combat. He harnesses a host of tactical tools to distract, slow, and burn his enemies. While he might not do as much damage as other Wayfinders, Silo supports his team by controlling the battlefield, locking down enemies, and afflicting them with multiple damage over time effects. Silo's signature weapon is the Longshot, a masterpiece crafted by the legendary Salen Vex. It allows Silo to show off his excellent marksmanship abilities, killing enemies before they even know what hit him. Longshot grants Silo access to the weapon ability Deadeye. On use, Deadeye marks enemies with weak spots. Hitting Deadeye weak spots guarantees Silo high damage critical hits. Deadeye allows only the best marksman to greatly increase Silo's damage output. Silo's passive is where his strategic advantage comes into play. He exploits enemies' weaknesses, dealing bonus melee and range damage to enemies that are debuffed. Silo has multiple ways of debuffing enemies, which allows for strategic advantage to have very little downtime when his abilities are used correctly. Next, let's check out Silo's four main abilities. I'm going to start with his second ability, as it has a special interaction with his first ability. Silo's second ability is Oil Bomb. On use, Silo throws an Oil Bomb, which leaves behind a pool of oil. Enemies within this pool are slowed and will take additional damage when hit. His first ability is Fire Bomb. Silo tosses a Fire Bomb that ignites enemies, dealing damage over time. If Fire Bomb is thrown onto a pool of oil, the pool and Fire Bomb combine to create an even deadlier explosion. Silo's third ability is Proto Clone. Silo dashes backwards, leaving behind a clone that pulls nearby enemies in. Nearby enemies are taunted and will attack the clone until it expires. Protoclone is the perfect get-out-of-jail-free card for Silo. It can be used as a way to transition from a melee weapon into a ranged weapon, or to get you out of any sticky situations you may find yourself in. Last up is Silo's ultimate, Arc Nemesis. Silo sends out a drone to shock all enemies, dealing a large burst of damage. The drone remains in the area for a short time, slowing and damaging nearby enemies. I personally like to use Arc Nemesis when using a ranged weapon when fighting melee enemies. Throw it down if you ever feel you're in danger. The shockwave creates a sort of safe zone around you, allowing you to take a breather in hectic situations. Silo's basic spell rotation will mostly be used when transitioning from melee into ranged, and should be used when surrounded by a group of enemies. It can still be used while starting off with ranged weapons, if an enemy quickly gap closes onto you. His basic spell rotation is pretty simple and will consist of first using Protoclone to dash backwards and away from the enemies, forcing them to stand in place while they attack the clone. This is followed by Oil Bomb, coating all enemies attacking our Protoclone, and then finished with Fire Bomb, resulting in a large explosion. Arc Nemesis can be used in between Oil Bomb and Fire Bomb if it is off cooldown, but I prefer to hold on to it for the situation I mentioned previously. Silo is looking to be a great option as a starter Wayfinder if you prefer a ranged and somewhat supportive playstyle. I'll definitely be selecting him as my starter. Thanks for checking out my Silo character spotlight. Make sure to subscribe and stay ahead of the curb with my Wayfinder guides and breakdowns. I'll see you all in game soon.